Good morning. Oh, it's so misty and cool looking. I think I'll cross that off the list of things I've never seen before. You can't tell what it is because I'm cycling and it's bloody bumped. What the hell? They're on like surfboards. But paddling. They're just doing it like it's like a casual everyday occurrence as well. So I decided I'll vlog and cycle next to them as well. Why the hell not? Um, good morning and welcome to another day of the video diary. I've been up quite a long time. It's now daytime if you haven't noticed, lol. Uh, I got up at seven after three hours sleep, maybe. It's, it's a bloody cruel world, you know, having to wake up that bloody early, that little sleep on a Sunday, but had to be done. Um, especially as well, I was having a dream about setting my alarm as the alarm went off. So I kind of like rolled over like, oh no, it's not meant to be now. I looked at the time like, ah, oh, shit. So yeah, I've been up and I've programmed a couple of, I think about four or five actually, programs for my mandatory coursework. Not the big coursework, just the little coursework. I've now just got the optional ones that even though they say optional, you've still got to do, kind of, because it's practice, it's programming, it's what it's all about. So I've still got those to do, but hey. So I got up, did that, got dressed, had some cheese and beans on toast, donned my old swimming t-shirt. It's the oldest t-shirt I own, and it's still too big for me. Um, and now we're cycling to work. Yay. And it's caught to, so I ought to go really and stop cycling slow. Pfft. Easy, easy. The hill's like it's not even there anymore. Balls to the hill, who cares? Mildly sweaty like, but otherwise it's nice and easy. Nice and easy. Oh, gosh. 20 minutes that took. 20 minutes. Same as last time, that's good. It's pretty freaking good. No stops either, I forgot my water bottle because I'm an idiot. So no stops for water or anything. Incredible. That driver's looking at me like I'm a right weirdo. I even thought about quitting. About a third of the way up, I'm like, what are you doing? You don't have to do this, just walk. And I thought, no, you're gonna be annoyed with yourself if you don't. So I kept on bloody going. Otherwise then, since we're outside, and we're not inside, we'd have to look at the boring back wall. What's happened today? What happened at work? I told you before work, didn't I? I did, I remember. Uh, work today was actually pretty good. It wasn't like my old job standards, but it was tolerable. I, could, I dealt with it today. It was quite, I wouldn't say fun. It was, it was there still. I didn't enjoy it, but yeah, it was good. It was good. Good, not enjoyable, but good. That makes sense, right? I mean, if you think about it, lots of things are good, but not enjoyable. Like Brussels sprouts. Yeah, work was a bit like Brussels sprouts. They're good for you. And no, but I actually, I don't like Brussels sprouts. I actually quite liked that. I didn't love it, but I liked it. There you go, that's the better metaphor. Had a mild, mild, mild running. Yeah, like really, really mild running with like the deputy manager. It wasn't even my fault this time. Blimey. I'll tell you about that when I get in, I think. So I was just pulling up to the university bit now. And I can deal with drivers looking at me weird because they can't shout anything at you out the window. He was looking at me weird. But pedestrians now look gross. Oh, put the beast back in a cage. Back home. I'm gonna get a helmet, by the way. I wanna get paid. Can't afford one. Don't worry, I'm safe. Vlogging and cycling on the road. What? Hi, Jess. Hello. Hi. How's it going? I'm good. good. What have you been saying? Uh, what have I done today? I went to work. Yeah. yeah. So, most of the clips in this well, I, I, what did you do today? <laughs> they know what I did today. What did you do? I went to, went to town. What did you get? Did you get anything cool from town? I got some antibiotics. Uh, antibiotics. Yeah. 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 I, I watched my dogs jump into a massive pile um, of milk. She has a black Labrador, like Sid, but not Sid. It's a Jasper. It's called Jasper. Such a good name. Yeah. It's kind of weird because there's so many of my voices talking at the same time. <laughs> so, cut, I guess. <coughs> well, that was a turn of events. I certainly wasn't expecting. Were you expecting anything like that? No. No, neither was I. What the hell happened, eh, when I got back, eh? Well, I guess first off, hello, my entire flat. How's it going, lol? Assuming you guys are watching, hi, how's it going? So yeah, um, everyone knows about this now, at least the daily vlogs, I'm not sure they've explored anywhere else. Um, so hey, I was kind of waiting for this to happen because, to be honest, vlogging in here is, is pretty, pretty, pretty bland looking look at this background all the time, so it's kind of refreshing being able to just walk around my own flat 
and vlog now, assuming that's okay, lol. Uh, so, so, what happened? I came back, and then I started cooking my din-dins, and then we had like a laptop party and the thing, I was doing some programming, as I normally do, come on, I'm just constant work, 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 as always. Um, God, I haven't told you about that either, have I? Bliff, bliff, bliff. Um, <laughs> Jesus, today's vlog has got a bit scrambled in the middle. Um, so yeah, came back, blah, 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 sat programming on the table, blah, 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 and it was great. And then we was talking, someone just mentioned something about a voice, and it reminded me of the Green Chino's voice. Do you remember? Green Chino's, that voice, yeah. Ain't your heart out, son. So I told that story again, basically. And I was like, what do you reckon that means? And then, then, Pajama Girl, otherwise known as Beth, Googled it. General tip, right? If you make videos on YouTube and you're you're not not entirely like willing to go to people and say, "Hey, look, I do this." Lol. Uh, don't directly reference the title of one of your. How many views did that get? I was gonna say most viewed, but that was three months ago. Seventy-six was a lot. It was three months ago. It's kind of average now. I think my my average is in the seventies, which is amazing. Lol. Uh, yeah, so literally, as they googled that, first hit on Google, my video. Of course it is. That's the only thing in the world that references those words in that combination, I assume. Um, so then they find it, and they're like, oh my god, it's you! All, like, five laptops are playing five different random videos, and then that was it, really. Everyone kind of knew at the same time. And you saw Jess. Jess, Jess is in my flat. She is, she's just down corridor. She's just up road. Probably in there now. Isn't that weird? There's no way to think about. So yeah, that happened, and it's a kind of relief because now I can like, I can talk like a normal kind of volume without people thinking that I'm weird. Well, they probably think I'm weird, but they know that I know they that I think they're weird. So yeah. Uh, elsewise, though, what really happened? Uh, oh, my little, and and then I've failed a programming. I've got thirteen done, which is an extra six, seven, or eight, I think, since I got in, which is good. No, no, it's not six, seven, or eight. It's about five. So I'm trying to ham it up. Uh, but we was in there talking and stuff, and everyone like some people had to take away. I cooked my ready meal, and then yeah, it was a bit like whoa, whoa. Um, so that was that. Really, that made perfect, legitimate sense. Um, I'm really tired. I had three hours sleep last night. I am running. I'm not running on empty, but at work I was like, oh man, if I could just close my eyes, I could just oh, I could just go to sleep if I close my eyes for too long. But I'm trying to go to bed early, which is what I'm talking to you now, while people are still awake. Uh, and they know anyway, so balls to it. Um, yeah, so I had a, a minor scuffle with the deputy manager today. Uh, because I drove... <laughs> she, uh, oh, my name badge was um, on my uh, jacket. And it's it's kind of there, and then... But as you walk in a jacket, if it's undone, it flays out, doesn't it? And, like, the lapel folds over, and it covers the name badge. And I have a short name, so it covers my entire name. And he said to me before, like, oh, by the way, your name's not thinged. You know, name's not thinged on your name badge thing, so if you just want to just wanna put it back... And I'm like, yeah, that's... Oh, sorry, I didn't realise. Lol, I'm, I'm working. I don't look down at my name badge all the time. Um, yeah, and he came up to me today. He did look like he was very happy. He was not happy. He was like, this is the second time I've had to tell you that your name badge is covered. I'm like, well, well it's not my fault. The lapel's designed wrong. The stitch, if the stitching wasn't there, then it wouldn't fold over, would it? And then I like, I tried to make a joke. It didn't work. It should not have made a joke in that situation. Technically, he threatened to fire me. No, he didn't. He threatened me to find a new job. But <laughs> Tip of the day, don't make jokes with people, especially managers, unless you are completely, entirely sure that they will take the joke correctly, because <laughs> that was probably... I could say that kind of crap at my old style, they wouldn't care. God, I was the person who, like, changed everything. I turned up, like, let's do this like this, this, do this like this. I was... Changed, revolutionized the way they did one, two, three different manners, and all of the managers knew me, and I was freaking employee of the year for... in within a year. And, uh, this store is just like, mm, no. Well, if you were gonna be like that, I was like, well... It's a good point. If you didn't have the stitch in there, and if you moved this thing there, then it wouldn't be a problem. And you wouldn't have to waste your time. People who are like that always suck up to them. That's my tip. That's another tip. <laughs> uh, if, if someone's like, oh no, you should you should do this, and then they think they're like powerful or whatever. Well, he obviously is powerful in manager. Um, but like really suck up to them. Just like, well, well, it's obviously, I know it's obviously a problem. I mean, you're, you're a manager, your time is very, it probably comes off properly like 
arrogant and like patronising. You're a manager and your time is like really yeah. important. And if you've got to go around telling loads of people that their name badge is sticking out, then it's got to be a massive waste of time and it's a massive problem for the company. So I totally understand. I'll move it. Blah blah blah. It was a bit awkward. <laughs> All. Um, yeah. So I'm gonna go to bed. I'm not gonna go to bed, but I'm gonna put some TV on slash YouTube because I've never watched TV since I got to university. Uh, and I'm going to to watch watch some videos send myself to sleep, which won't be hard at all, um, and then I'm going to get up early in the morning, do some programming, I'm, there's a lot of programming I need to do, so I need to get on to work now. Um, obviously Friday I've got, I've got a, no Wednesday I've got to take the day off because I'm going to London to go to a gig on Wednesday, so I'm not going to be able to work in Wednesday afternoon. So I've got to like, just got to be like, bang, to the point, getting shiz done. So yeah, get up early, 7 o'clock, uh, that gives me about two hours of programming in the morning, then I've got an hour lecture, then I've got to write up the notes from the hour lecture, more programming, then I've got, I'm not doing anything in that period am I? No. And then I've got a two hour lecture, then I go to work, then I come back from work, and then probably more programming and note writing up so that I haven't got any notes to write up for the next day. I've got to make sure it doesn't compile every day like that. Uh, Tuesday I've got quite a lot of time then. Yeah, I think I've got like I've got a good amount of time on Tuesday to get programming out of the way. I want this lab sheet done on Tuesday and then I can start my coursework in the latter half of the week. It's really hard balancing lab work and coursework because lab work has to be done every week. It's one lab work is coursework and it has to be done every week. But it's like loads of different small programs which you've got to make robust and stuff, blah blah blah. Um, so there's that, but then my coursework, which is in for a month's time just just over a month's time that's like there's no pressure to do it until that date and I've got to be able to do it so it's pressure I've got a program 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 I want to get a good portion of the coursework at least the first half of the coursework done by the end of this week it's gonna be hard it's gonna be hard and then there's the other coursework as well Psh, don't talk about that that's group coursework uh, so yeah that's all for today's video it's been a freaking weird one hasn't it Hi again guys, or bye again guys since I'm going, so I will catch you later I guess.